Alright, have you ever had a gun not fire? Well, this could be your problem. Uh, your trigger post may break. And it's happened to me twice. It's a stupid V2 gearbox design. Anyway, safety first, bitches. You'll need a drill press, a thing to insert in place of the uh, trigger post, you'll need a clamp, and you'll need a bit comparable to the thing you're inserting in the gearbox. For me, I inserted a 3 8 inch steel hardened screw, and I have a 3 8 inch drill bit made of cobalt. Wind it up on the drill press, get everything set, clamp it down, and line everything up. Make sure you line it up pretty much exactly to the place of the trigger post. Alright, drill your hole and put it in a vise. Put the thing in. It's a bit too long in my photograph, um, but I adjusted that. Uh, I measured a lot, and I fit everything in there until it fit. And this happens to be the correct length right here. Alright, once you're done, then you get your sure you wind everything up. Cut off the uh, outside here to make room for the selector plate to slide again. So cut it off. I used a Dremel with a cut off tool. Alright, so I cut it off. Um, be careful to watch those holes there for the trigger plug, um, or the switch assembly and the cutoff lever. Alright, grind it down and then sand it to make sure that the selector plate slides freely and there is no interference. That's what it should look like when it's done. Now put everything back together and test it to make sure it works. Yeah, so it might screw up your contact plug and your trigger uh, like, like in the photograph here, but you won't ever notice it when you're firing and it fires just normally. So. I also did this to my uh, inner reversal latch. The one on the left is from before, and the one on the right is from after. I just took my Dremel cutoff tool and put a slot for a screwdriver in the top part so I can uh, twist it and fire the gearbox without having to take like an Allen wrench or whatever and pulling it back. Like so. This And it makes the bevel gear easier to insert when you're putting the gearbox back together. Here's everything. Phillips head on the right is pointing to the new pin I put in, and the one on the left is pointing to the anti reversal edge. If you have any questions about what I've done here, PM me on airsoftforum.com. My name is Heath OVC, H E A T H O V C, all one word. Or you can post in the comments down below and I'll get email updates and try to answer them back. Thanks for watching.